All right, guys, this is gonna be day three. We're gonna start with some squats. If you have multiple dumb, um, kettlebells, you can do a double dumbbell. Um, most people have more dumbbells than they have kettlebells, but either is fine. We're gonna raise up to the shoulders and we're gonna do our squats. I'll show you from the side. Again, if you have some shoulder mobility issues and getting the weights up here is challenging, stick with the goblet squat that we did on day one where you're holding the weight at the front like this. All right, next we're gonna move into overhead weighted lunges. Again, this does require some mobility overhead, so if you're limited here, do the same lunges that we did on day one, either with the weights at your side or here on your shoulders. So overhead, the weights are overhead, and I'm lunging. Some people find it a little easier to do one dumbbell as they lunge. And then you would just alternate um, your arms on each side. Next, we have our shoulder presses. So you'll see that these are programmed um, twice because shoulder strength is important. So here, we're gonna press up. And the last weightlifting movement for this move is the bent over rows. Again, all the ladies wanna work on this area here for aesthetic purposes, but for strength wise, this is another area where we're pushing and pulling, whether we're doing light work at work, on the keyboard, doing these kind of repetitive motions. We want these to be stronger so that our traps aren't doing the work, causing chronic neck pain. So again, we're gonna hip hinge forward and we'll row each side. All right, and then to finish out, we'll do some core, um, some core work with hollow holds and supermans or super persons. So hollow holds look like this. Start with arms down, shoulders up and the feet out. This can also be done like this for a little bit modified, okay? And then it can also be done with legs up and arms out. Keeping in mind that we want the low back touching the ground. So if to, in order to do this, your back arches up, we don't want that. So modify. And then the super person looks like this where the arms come out in front, the legs are gonna pick up so your quads are off the ground and the arms are gonna come up. So we're using buttocks and the spinal rector muscles, tightening, strengthening. So again, you'll hold those to your current strength level, 15 seconds, 20 seconds, 30 seconds, and so on.